Let Garmin show you how to restore mapping on your Overlander using a Mac computer. Your Overlander may only show major highways if the mapping on your device is not enabled. You may receive the map data is not available message if your mapping data has been deleted. First, let's ensure your maps are enabled. To check this, begin on the main drive and explore screen. Then, select settings in the bottom right, followed by navigation. Next, select map and vehicle. Then, select my maps. Here, we will see a list of available maps on your device. A check mark in the box indicates the maps are enabled, allowing your device to navigate in these areas. If you are in North America, we are looking for CN North America NT, followed by a year, version, and the word all. Select the box if it is unchecked to enable the mapping. Then select OK. We can then use the circle icon at the bottom to return to the home screen. Here, we can enter an address or select a point of interest to verify your device's map data has been restored. Your Garmin device should calculate a route. If the necessary mapping was not listed under My Maps, your mapping will need to be reinstalled. This may have occurred due to a recently failed map update. Keep in mind, a failed wireless update can cause mapping to be deleted due to a download interruption or reduced download speed when using a cell phone hotspot. We will not want to use the Wi-Fi download process if you receive the map data is not available error after attempting a Wi-Fi update. If this is the case, we will need to reinstall the maps. We can reinstall the maps using a computer with a home high-speed internet connection and Garmin Express. In this video, we will be using a Mac computer. To begin, plug your Garmin device into the computer using the included USB cable. Ensure Garmin Express is up to date if it is already installed on your computer. To check, click Garmin Express in the Apple menu bar. Then, click About Garmin Express. Next, click Check for Updates to Express. A You're Up to Date message will appear if you have the current version. Click Install Now if there is a new version available. If you don't have Garmin Express, you need to download and install it. To begin, open your internet browser and navigate to garmin.com forward slash express. Keep in mind, we do not want to do an internet search for garmin.com using Google, Bing, or other search engines. This will provide pages of results, many of which are not affiliated with Garmin, even if they have the word Garmin in their name. Some of these sites charge for assistance. Garmin does not charge fees for the support of its products. Those impersonating Garmin may also ask to gain remote access to your computer. Garmin will not request access to your computer. Once you're at Garmin's website, click Download for Mac. Then, click the Garmin Express.dmg file. If you are unfamiliar with locating downloaded programs on your Mac, just hold Option, Command, and L on your keyboard to access your downloads. This will display all your downloaded programs. Then, click Garmin Express.dmg. The Garmin Express installer will now open. Then, click Install Garmin Express.pkg followed by Continue. Click Continue again. Next, read the license agreement and click Continue. Then, agree to the terms. Click Install. If a password prompt appears while installing Garmin Express, enter your Mac's username and password. Then click Install Software. Next, Click OK. Click Close when the installation completes. Followed by Move to Trash. Once you have Garmin Express installed, click Add a Device. Then click Add Device. 
Once Garmin Express has added your device, if you choose, you can register your device by adding your email address in the box. You will also have the option to receive product news and exclusive offers. Then, single left click Next. You can now add a nickname to your device. This isn't necessary, but can be useful if you have multiple devices. Then click Next. You will then have the option to share your device data with Garmin to improve our products and apps. This is optional and will not impact the usability of your device. Click Yes or No. Now, we can reinstall the map on your device. To begin, click Map Details. Then, click Options below the North America map. Next, click Reinstall Map. Lastly, read the important notes and click Continue. The map update process will now begin. The map update is large and may take a few hours to complete. Be sure to keep your device plugged in until Garmin Express shows a green bar with the updates complete message. You can now enter an address on your device to verify your mapping has been restored. And that's it. For more help, visit support.garmin.com. Thanks for watching.